Hey guys, it's Arnie and welcome to my kitchen. Today, we are going to cook pork goulash. Pork goulash is a Romanian Hungarian pork stew and this is something similar to a Philippine pork a fritada. So I'm going to cook this recipe today because it was requested by my friend Rosalie Oldjoy from Australia. So this is my take for the pork goulash. So guys, if you are all ready, let's start. In this recipe, I use half kilogram of pork chops as well as just four cloves of garlic and two medium size onion and two large size of tomatoes. Then we need black pepper as well as salt and vegeta. Vegeta is a vegetable seasoning. If you don't have it, you can use the vegetable cubes. Then paprika. Paprika is a very important ingredient of this recipe. We also need peppers. I added jalapeno because I want it a little spicy and carrots and parsnip as well as potato. I cannot find a celery green so I use a celery stock and then I use two and a half cups of water and butter. And for the pork chops, cut it into a bite size. And for the two large tomato, just uh, dice it. Then dice the two medium onion and finely chop the garlic. And then dice the celery as well and slice the potato into small cubes. And again, dice the peppers and slice the parsnip and carrots into small pieces. And now let's begin to cook our pork galash. And so when the butter is ready, we can saute the onion and the garlic. And when the onion is translucent, we can now add the diced tomato and diced peppers. And now we can add our paprika and vegeta or vegetable seasoning. We stir it and let it simmer for about five minutes. Then add the meat, salt, and pepper. And then stir it for about 30 seconds. And when it's completely mixed, you can now add the water. Stir it again and let it simmer for about 45 minutes to an hour. When it's ready, you can add the carrots and parsnip and simmer it for another 10 to 15 minutes. And you can add the potato and celery and again simmer it for about 10 to 15 minutes. You can add water when needed. And now look at our pork goulash. Look at the creamy orangey sauce with a lot of vegetables. Okay guys, another recipe has been done. And if you have some suggestions or comments, please leave me a message. You are free to share this recipe as well. And of course, it will be my pleasure for you to subscribe to our channel. Thank you guys and see you soon.